Yeah, 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 but my actual jersey number I wore when I was hooping in high school. And my warm-up jersey is right here on the back of my motherfucking one to stand. That was a good one. Hey, what's up to my LC Nation? My LC gang gang, my LC crew. Hey, what's going on? Out there in the level, you living, you did. But hey, man, we back, we back, we back with another reaction video. Let me tell y'all. This right here is another epic, iconic, epic reaction video. Can y'all dig that? With a trumpet jack. Trump on jack. Boo, 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 boo. Tough acting to Nath, baby. Shout out to Calvin Harris, Young Thug, and Dua Lupia. You dig. But as you can see from the title of the video, man. This is my reaction to Dua Lupia featuring Young Thug and Calvin Harris Portion. Is that right? Potion Official Music Video. 2022 Money go, 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 go. I'm gonna have some real words. That's for the girls. Yeah. Now cut the music. Now truly you know, listen, man. Listen in my DJ Khaled voice, man. Shout out to DJ Khaled, man, and my home girl Pretty Loves Pink, man. I did get a chance to speak with her, man, in regards to the Jimmy Butler and them situation. Now, this was not, this was before the fact. And she was like, yeah, she was on live stream one day on Twitch and I called her and I was like, what's up, Pinky? And I was asking about if they were going to turn up and stuff. And she's like, yeah, we about to do a parade. And I think this video shot in Miami, so I have to speak on it that way. But anyway, man, I'm like, man, you know, that's going to be dope, man. Y'all, she said, we about to do a parade and stuff. And... Buckets, what happened? Come on, Buckets. You came down, you could have drove past Horford, man, and got the sweet boots off the glass, put up for net. But you put up for a treat. Hey, it happens, I understand. Okay? But, damn I mean, it. I was looking forward to South Beach. We about to go down. That's it right there. We're going down and kick it, man. We, we still going. Okay, straight up at that. And Pinky, I still want my 1v1. You did. Okay, but anyway, anyhow, anywho, uh, we're about to react to this video. This is brand new. I done skipped a, skipped a lot of videos to do this, and I'm going to do that future video. I had just recorded it with him featuring Drake and the, the medieval theme and stuff. And I love that. My girlfriend, my, my, my fiance, not like it. After she loved it. The medieval stuff, we watch a lot of medieval stuff. Don't you like the medieval stuff, Aunt Yeah. Yeah, she liked the medieval stuff. And I'm telling y'all, man, this is dope. It was a dope music video right now. It's blowing up, too, so, you know, I'm reacting to my constituents. I did tell them, like, man, future is starting to take off. Okay, for real, it's like he becoming like the number one. Well, Kanye still is number one. Okay, Jigga close to, but Future is easing up that chart. Okay, because he out there for real, resonating. He out there. Okay, but um, yeah, I just said no. It's hot than the mother sucker. Okay, and we're about to react to this reaction. Okay, uh, we're about to react to this react. We're about to react to this video. So, oh uh, yeah, are y'all ready? Are y'all ready? Well, okay, let's get in let go. Shout out to Damien and Bianca. And see this little cool word to you, dig it. D, D, G, and Corey and Common and the Diamond Life. I'm watching her right now. She's talking about Chris Sale. You dig on talking about and how he missed Queen Nigel and all this from that. And my fiance, SJ, here I go. Yeah, yeah, she right over there, there. And all those in the game. I'll be watching on the regular with these Ray Banks, man. So are y'all ready? Are y'all ready? Well, okay, let's get it. Let go! 
Okay, y'all, man, welcome to LC The One Reacts, man. If y'all new, man, please subscribe to the channel, man, and turn the notification bell button on, man. I'm telling y'all, that'd be the greatest thing that you ever did in your lifetime is stop by LC The One and get some what? Entertainment, okay? Spit up and down and everything in the game with these red bands, man. But anyway, um, turn, subscribe to the channel, okay? So if y'all new, man, uh, subscribe. If y'all didn't know for all those that are here and those that are new, I am doing a cash giveaway, okay? Flip up and down, because we on the road to 11K subscribers on this channel. And also, we on the road to 2K subscribers on LC Run BX. So, when I get to these milestones on both channels, there will be a cash giveaway, like I just said, okay? When I get to 11K on LC One, there will be a $1,000 cash giveaway, okay? Then when I get to 2k subscribers on lc one bx that will be a 500 dollars giveaway and my taraji p here's what 500 dollars future 500 dollars okay okay when i get to that mark on that channel okay so basically uh the criteria all you have to do for this is basically subscribe to my jericho drink uh, green voice i've watched on this video like because he ain't in this car he in this crib turn on the notification bell button Comment on the video, y'all gotta comment, man. And like the video, that's it. Subscribe, turn the post notification bell button on so y'all can get alerted. Comment on the video and sub and like it, okay? That's it, man, okay? And those that subscribe, well, comment the most. I'm all this about this hot. With those that comment the most on the videos, man, this will instantly put you in the top 10 for the cash prize giveaway, okay? So yeah, that's not comment on these videos. Comment on everything, everything, okay? Yeah, okay. And you'll be one of the top candidates when we get to that mark on both channels. And also, please have a cash app, okay? Because this is my third giveaway, and I had a hell of a time giving away my last giveaway to a young P V L seven. He was fourteen. They didn't have no parental discretion, and I had to give him some scratch offs, okay? So. We're not doing that no more, okay? Y'all have to find your grandmama, your daddy, auntie, or somebody, if you little, to get the cash, the cash app or something, okay? We want to get this dope dope, okay? But up that. But anyway, uh, now that has been said, now I'm going to let y'all know how I react to my music videos. So basically, I do my reactions in the form of a director's point of view. And what is that? I'm going to tell you what it is, okay? So basically, all I do is I critique the music videos, okay? And I critique everything. And when I mean everything, I critique everything in the music video. I critique the sound. I critique the wardrobe. I critique how still this water is right here. It's purple right now. I critique if you're smoking, if you got tattoos on your face, if you got diamonds in your mouth like y'all do. I critique everything. <laughs> God bless me. And I mean everything, okay? So at the end of the music video, I give you a grade, okay? I give you a grade. This is your traditional grading scale. However, and but, 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 those are two conjunctions right there, okay? I give you a grade from A, B, C, D, F, okay? And then, this is the unconditional way I do. I give you, what, an A plus 35, okay? Or I can give you a B minus 79, okay? Or something like that to the effect, okay? Y'all get it? Y'all understand that? Well, okay then. Okay, and if you are below satisfied, that means you gotta bring your grade up to percentile. And if you are over satisfied, that means you are Escalante in my door explorer voice. You dig? Okay, so now y'all understand that. We're about to get right into this music video. So y'all ready? Are y'all ready? I forgot to do this last video. So here we go, yo. Here we go, yo. Are y'all y'all ready for the video? Yeah, y'all ready? Get your stoky, get your what? Your gin and juice, get everything so you can react. Well, sit back in Chisnell and watch me do this, you did. Okay, now this right here is giving me some Hype Williams type of vibe, okay? Because Hype Williams was the top director in the 90s. For music videos and everybody wanted to get hype Williams on the on the video direction. This and this this video right here is kinda interesting. Is her name Goya or something? Like the like the stuff you, the Goya beans and all that? Okay, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna do her video too as well. Okay? I think I screamed I think I did scream before. But anyway, um this is interesting so far. It's starting off still water, okay, nice panoramic view, okay, flying over the ocean, okay, something like that. 
maybe a, a drone or something. But it looked good, slow panning and stuff. I could dig it. Then the titles come in. This is another movie cut frame. Okay, just like we seen Justin, but Justin, you know, that was the cliffhanger thing. Okay, so uh, it's called Potion. Okay, so we want to see what they're talking about and if they pretty much the narrative is talking about Potion. I know what Potion is, right? Did you see the water? It's purple, so that means that's a special drink or something or something that they mix up to get you hypnotized or something like that, okay? To get you, like, you know, the hypnotic and they call them the, 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 the Hennessy and the hypnotic you mix together call the Crypt, uh, the Incredible Hulk and all that. It turned green. Okay, but anyway, that's what Potion is. It's mixing up something. And y'all know from the Scooby Doo's and all that stuff, and they put the special stuff in, then it would just smoke be coming out the, the drink. <laughs> and they, it's the person still drinking. Huh? Okay, but anyway, y'all understand what I'm talking about. So anyway, uh, yeah, look good so far. So let's see if they follow the script now. Okay, that look gothic right there. Okay, so far, the visual... It's kind of making you think about stuff like that, the imagination of, you know, like fantasy and stuff, okay? Superheroes and all that stuff, like I just described, like a few cartoons and stuff like that. So that's what this looking like. It look gothic so far. Okay, look, good business so far. I like the visual. Let's see if the script talking about something. Okay. Now I cut to a, a scene. They on the, now you can see it's a beach setting right now. And it like it was an accident or something because it's a car on the beach. Okay. Um, based off what we've seen, we've seen water. So, of course, there got to be some land somewhere, some landscape somewhere. So now they're on surface now. Okay. Somewhere. And it's a beach or something or island or something. So I guess this little dupe is she upside down in the car. Okay. Let's see what she's talking about. Okay, but she talking about you know they in the club sitting or something like that, and they cut to that after she upside down the car. Okay, now this is potion, so I guess somebody gave her the woo wop you did. Okay, now she had an accident. Okay, because she was drinking the potion, now she realizing what happened. Now she was like, we were in the club and everything was all right. So she's starting to recollect about what happened. She was in the club and it cut to that scene. We seen all these shadows, a silhouette of these people in shades, okay? So the, I, I'm, I'm trying to break it down for y'all because I understand, okay, uh, plots and stuff like that because I am a director, okay? And that's what we're doing right now. I'm giving y'all the meat of what this stuff mean, these symbolisms. Okay, let's get back to it. Now, uh, she is discombobulated right now. She confused, okay? She had an accident. I don't know why the car is on a beach, okay? We don't know why that, but now she got Thug coming in, you know, this thorn showing like glimpses of him, you know, it's like a cutaway shot, okay, and uh, he fading into, it's like a, what's this, a depth of field, there's something in the background of him as he fading in and stuff like that, so uh, I guess he's the culprit in this, this, this situation, he ain't said nothing yet, but she just speaking, okay, about him being on the side, you supposed to be in the car with me, right? But we by my side on the night when I almost die. But he he chilling. Okay, okay. He started a trick on us. He said, uh, "Midnight, such and such, and you sprinkle with a little emotion." So he 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 sprinkled some potion in her drink. Okay, then he let her drive. Okay, and I guess, well, I guess she dozed off or something, or something happened. He got out the car. That's what happened. That's what, what happened was. And she had an accident, but how did she end up on a beach? How did she end up on a beach? Okay, let's get back to it. 
Okay. See, now she's telling the tale of what happened that night. Okay. It was a lot of stuff going on. It was getting erotic and stuff. It was getting hot in the club that it was in. Okay. And uh, that's what normally happens though. When you go to these clubs and I was always told, you never leave your drink unattended. If you walk away from that drink, if you go to a bar or anything, you take your drink, which you go to the washroom, ladies, take your drink, which if you leave it unattended and you come back, if you ain't got nobody to watch it, somebody can dab some stuff in your I see it all the time, though. It, it's real. My uncle told me a story about a female that she did that and left her drink unattended. <clears throat> somebody put some stuff in it and it messed her mind up. I'm talking about she was crazy for the rest of her life. Yep. For real. Uh, so, I think this will happen in this scenario right here. Let's break it down like a fracture for y'all. Y'all feel me? Yeah. Yeah. I've been catching love off a pet. Running from your letters on this track before. Okay. He said, I've been catching love off the back, boy. Running from your love like a track. Okay. So now, he giving his, his uh, rebuttal to what she talking about. Okay, and he was like, I, okay, we was cool, we was there kicking and stuff like that, but you know, it wasn't nothing else. Okay, I, I ain't got nothing to do with that. Okay, you had to ask on the beach. I'm just trying to get away from it. Okay, but up and down, we cool and stuff like that, you know, but I can't, we can't be together like that no more. Okay, because you got too many issues, you got stuff going on, and I don't know what's going on now. Okay, so you trying to blame that on me. Okay, he said, I ran off on the plug. That's what he said. But they making it. They making it. This is real deal. They making this say like it's a fairy tale. But this this really happened. Okay, let's get back. Never pretend to pretend. No, I'm just being better than my own. I've been catching love for that. Running from your love is what's trapped. Okay. See, I'm. He said, I'm. I've been catching love off the bait. Come on. Basically, off the rebound, right? After me and you gone, split up. I've been catching love. You know, I've been getting. Plenty of females out there. I've been catching ugly rebound again. Bad boy running from your love, getting away from you. Okay, but you still coming back to me. I was just in the club. Okay, probably performing or something. Seeing me, you want to be Kendall Flames? No, it ain't going down like that. So, I guess they had some type of interaction, and I don't know if he went well, but she ended up flipping over that cop. Let's get back to the squares and See? He was like, he said, we went to such a corner, so today we have to go get another drink or something. And now you trying to like, he said, why you going to do that for? Why you going to allow me for? Okay? <clears throat> After that, we don't know what happened. You probably blanked out of something, driving or something. But I wasn't in the car with you or something like that. Anyway, she survived it. And now he got to deal with this, okay? Yeah. We 14 honor, just like a minor. On yellow, three, these witness dinosaurs. 15 may hold us, I'm undecided. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Now he's saying, you 14 like you a minor. With such and such a dream, oh, Lord Jesus. So he really didn't get himself. That's why he backed up off her. Because she's a PBL7. She probably got in the club, but she was underage. I just seen a movie like that. Did we just see a movie like that? We went to the show and seen that, didn't we? Yes. We just seen a movie. I swear to God, we just seen a movie. That movie was called Emergency. Remember that? This is the same scenario. I swear to God. But this is a music video. This is emergency right here. This is an emergency situation that he got going on. Remember that after? And that girl was 14 years old. And that girl was in that man's house throwing up. And them boys came up in there. And they got in hella trouble that night. Wow, this is the same stuff. I swear to God, if y'all ain't seen emergency, y'all gonna see emergency, huh? Yeah, y'all. She was underage though. Yeah. So he just said, "I'm backing up off you." I'm like, "Cause you a minor." Whoa, whoa. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm breaking this stuff down. I'm telling you. Okay. Cause this probably really happened. 
Cause we seen movies so. though. Okay, let's get back to it. Now he said, I'm serving bricks. Okay. You know what I mean? Captain Manny. You know, he's talking about what's going on. He said, no. And uh, we don't want to get all into that because now he's under investigation. And I don't know if it's because of this song. Because y'all know, y'all thug did he under investigation for one of the songs that he was talking, he was, the lyrics that he was saying. He in jail right now because of this. I swear to God, y'all know it's going. It's real. I don't know if this is song right here. This came out what? This come out. Cause this is one of the songs they was talking about. Uh, well, one of the I, I don't know if this is one of the songs, but Young Thug is in jail right now with somebody else. No cap for his lyrics, Lil Dupia. I gotta be careful with y'all saying these songs, man. Let's see. I just want to see when it came out, this video. This video just came out. This, this video is, uh... Four days old. No telling when they shot it though, but they get six million views now. But he's supposed to be in jail still right now. Okay, let's get back to it. Gucci clip bars and joggies. You know me when I choose to stay with the music. And you by my side. See? And then she getting, she, well, she was already descriptive. She already told a lot. But she was telling the date that it happened and stuff. And you both me by my side. Some went down. But she almost died, okay? And he know where to be found, okay? And he telling his side of the story, okay. They got the, the Scarface um, theme in the back, that, that, you know, one of them sound. Cause I could tell, I could tell, cause they tried to make it sound like that. Cause this is a all, this is a Miami thing. Y'all see the palm trees and stuff like that, so we know where the set is at. Cause he in Miami, okay, with this, okay. But anyway, man, uh, this is good so far. Uh, my time has run through, but we gonna we gonna keep it going just a little bit more. But I wanna really dissect this, man, for real. Okay, what is the, what is the sites? But I know what that is. It's got to be some new stuff. Okay, some new stuff that's getting people out their mind. Okay, put up and down. Hand. I'm not no none of that stuff. Okay, I just keep it 100. You know, and that's basically how a lot of these dudes they control. You know, these females and stuff because y'all know the sex trade is real. It's a lot of it's a lot of prostitution going on, man. It's a lot of stuff going on. But if you get caught up in the sex trade, they cuffing people, man. They got people with sex slaves. Got them in dungeons and stuff, man. It's real out here, man. It's not this is not no game. But this is one way they control it, man. They use these anti amphetamines uh, and stuff like that, man. To subdue these vulnerable women. Okay? That's what this is all about right here. You know? And I'm going to keep it 100 for real. Women like to get high. They like getting high. Okay? They love getting high. And dudes, they pray off that, man. They really do. You know, it's like I never was like that, man. It's like I, I just can't, I can't be around no, no female like that. You see, I mean, I can, like, we socially together, but not, like, every day you got to be high. I can't do it, man. It's like, you know, that's like living with a monster, okay, because you're not in your mindset, you can't think, you know, that's the only way you can function, you got to be high, you know, and you know when they get high, they're not in their mindset, so they can do anything, and because I done had my little experiences and stuff, man, and, you know, did my own little, uh, 
my case studies and stuff like in shot riding through okay straight up and down on a ride along no that's not ride along ride through okay and nobody really be in their mindset when they be outside doing stuff you know they be how can I put it they be induced by something okay they do okay but uh yeah uh, we gonna end it right there, man. This, this is very interesting, you know. That's why I'm doing these reactions, man, to get y'all the underlining of what really these videos are about, man. These are videos, they ain't tell. But you know, uh, cause don't nobody do it like that. You know, they just react to it like you know. But I give y'all the, but I'm a director, you know, and I just try to figure out why do we make stuff like this, and if it's a, what's the narrative. For the video okay you gotta be a good story if it's real or if it's fake because this stuff ain't simple these simplest too this stuff has a lot of merit okay it carries a lot of weight in the world man for real for real like they use new videos like different uh cinematography stuff film you know to disseminate messages to people man this stuff be real they throw some in the movie like like all the Tupac stuff and all the visual stuff he was doing in his videos and stuff, you know, they still studying that to this day, okay? Because it, you gotta think about why a person would make this stuff, okay? Why would they make this type of, these type of videos and stuff like that? If some of the stuff weren't real, it's supposed to be fantasy, but it's reality, okay? It's for real, the stuff happens for real. People be making this because they it's part of it, their dissemination to control the mindset. Okay, control people's minds. Okay, yeah, but uh, this was very interesting. You know, the narrative for what it, I guess you could say, you know, what what she was saying, the sprinkles, this and that, and that could, you know, correlate there with being a potion, especially you know, cause she was talking about that because they got big break drugs out here, and she would build coffee went through, and you know, he sprinkles with new stuff and people drinks they won't even know what's going on you know give them a cup of drinks and girl turn their head ah laughing and stuff there you go pop that stuff in there and they out of there Jack. wake up next thing you know they somewhere and all different type of stuff and then the girl y'all better be careful that's why you chained up in the dungeon man it's real out here these streets boy these some crazy motherfuckers out here nowadays Jack. Turn up and down. but yeah um this was interesting the narrative kind of threw me off, but I understand it. So, but the visual is incredible too. The same cuts was different, you know, it's like, but it really meant something. So there's some real symbolism behind it. Yeah, I'm about to watch this myself and fool them to really, you know, understand what's going on. But anyway, man, I'm gonna give this a, I'm gonna give this an A plus five. I think it's a really interesting movie. No cap for my rappers. Yeah. Okay, y'all, let me forget about it, man. Hey, this your boy, LC The One, baby. LC The One reacts to you dig. A-K-A, -A Illmatic One. Truth up. And not the mother sucking gang numbers, man. But my actual jersey number I wore when I was hooping in high school. And my warm-up jersey right here in the back of my mother sucking one the spin. Like I was saying, they keep pimping and avoid slipping. Because they will get your mother sucking ass. If you slip on that motherfucking banana peel, you dig what I'm talking about, man? And like I always say, man, church from wherever you got Before we leave, shout out to my LC Nation, my LC Gang, and my LC Crew. I need y'all to like this video. <laughs> Share this video everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. Comment on this music video, man. And most importantly of all, man, subscribe to my YouTube channel, man. And turn the notification bell button on. Ding! To get more exclusive reactions. From your view to be asking good root. And like I always say, man, trust me, remember, God, we gone. In a five, a four, a three, a two, a one, church. And now, and uh, we going this way. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hey, man. 
I'm just gonna keep it 100 with y'all, man. Just for all y'all niggas out there, man. Yeah. They're saying I ain't the OG, the original. Yeah. Hey, man. Use a duplicate. Yeah. Use a duplicate. Use a dude, nigga. Yeah. Use a duplicate, nigga. Use a duplicate. Yeah. Use a dude, nigga. And I'm the original motherfucking OG, nigga. Yeah, don't forget to get your custom t-shirts, you dig what I'm talking about from LC the one. You see the custom prints all over the shirt, you dig what I'm talking about. We ain't playing no game. The custom sweater, you dig what I'm talking about, yeah. Uh-huh. With the back end print on the same. I got the t-shirts as well. You did unisex, long sleeve. You dig now we got the full zip up. You dig what I'm talking about. Straight up with the hood on it. Straight up with the back print as well. You dig what I'm talking about. We ain't playing no game. And then I got the full zip up. Custom with the pockets on it and stuff. You dig what I'm talking about. Back print. And sleeve and print. You dig on talking about prints everywhere. Then I got the yoga pants. You dig on talk joggers. You dig on talking about for men. And I got the crop new t shirts for the ladies. You dig on talking about. Look at that. She look comfortable in it. Uh huh. Then I got the sports bra. You dig on talking about. Get the sports bra. You dig on talking about the back print print. You dig on talking about the back print print. You dig on talking about. We ain't playing no game. And then I got the yoga pants for the ladies. You dig on talking about. Bike or booty shorts. You dig on talking about. So that put that piece can round out. You dig on talking about. Then I got the, the yoga leggings. You dig on talking about flakes over she jogging and everything and I got the capris right there with the custom LC right between the thighs you dig and I got the the custom socks you dig on tomorrow you ain't gonna find no more socks like that nowhere on the planet and then last but not least I got the LC the one jersey you dig on talking about then I got the back print on there look at that back print look good then I got the Illmatic one my street ball jersey with the two fold on it and then I got the little sleeve pull up bag right there for the ladies you dig on draw straight back and then I got the real backpack you know what I'm talking about LC the one look at the Back. Look at the front. You think I'm look at the top. You think I'm talking about everything is looking good. You think I'm talking about and they'll see the ones neighborhood. And then I got the X Star iPhone 10 case. You think I'm talking about and then I got the iPhone 6 case 7, 8, 9. Let's order what you want. And then I got the custom print. You think I'm talking about LC the one baby. And then I got the custom mug. And when you want to get drunk and drink and stuff to my stream. And then I got the snuggle pillow when you want to get snuggled with your lady. Yeah.